One coach who had a huge impact on my life would be my high school coach, Tom Finn. When I came into high school, I knew that I wanted to be a distance runner and Coach Finn had been a soccer coach for years, but it was his first time coaching cross country. And so we had to work together to figure things out. Hey! Hey, how you doing? What's up, coach? How's it going? I'm doing all right. How's the surgery go? Oh, uh, it went well. Finally raced yesterday for the first time. That's great. While I may have been the only one spiking up, he was the one who was responsible for getting me both physically and especially mentally ready to perform. It was truly a we. You and I shared a lot of books before right. finding you know, the couple that really, really worked for us. Did you ever think that you'd be reading about track so much as you ended up doing? I don't know. I don't know. And that was probably because you cared so much about it. I was a stubborn 14-year-old kid at points, and we definitely had some arguments, and we butted heads at times. Do you remember the time that we got into uh, an argument about training, and you came into my classroom, and you pulled me out? <laughs> A week before a really big race, he showed me the training schedule and I didn't necessarily agree with it. And you came into class, asked the teacher for me, pulled me out and brought me into the, the conference room. When he pulled me out of class, I remember initially being furious. Why are we doing this in the middle of the day? And you explained step by step why we were doing everything that we were doing. The fact that it was so important to him that I understand the process of training let me know how much he cared. You were able to control my emotions because you were so into the numbers. Right. Once I realized that he cared so much, I was able to really buy in and believe in what we were doing. Do you remember your sophomore year when you won the Indoor National 5K? That was a disaster. I threw up on the track in the middle of the race. <laughs> and you came off the track <laughs> and you said to me, you said I was ready for this. <laughs> and I said, what do you want me to tell you? You weren't ready for it? <laughs> <laughs> I was not ready for that one. No, but we wanted you to run it so that you would have the experience. I think had I never had Coach Finn in my life that there's a good chance I wouldn't have the same love and appreciation for the sport that I do today. And I think that really is because together we made it so enjoyable. Whenever I think back on being coached by you, I always just think of the fact that that's where I fell in love with the sport and I just feel like I owe a lot of the fact that I'm still running today to the way that we started. Oh, it's nice to hear that. It's nice to hear that. It was a good run. It was a good run. It was definitely a good run. The most concrete thing that he would always say to me is that if I just focused on myself, that eventually the field will narrow. Even today as a professional athlete, that principle still holds true. Well, good luck to you guys this season. Thank you. Take care. Have a good one. Nominate your coach today for the 2019 Hometown Hero Award presented by Rocket Mortgage by Quicken Loans and Flow Sports.